Hey folks, it's Antar, and I'm back for round two of Purple Kazooie's uh, Monocolor Tournament. And my opponent today is none other than Purple Kazooie himself. Um, I was originally paired with someone else in the second round, um, but due to some dropouts in the tournament, not the guy who was originally against, but some other people, um, the Purple Kazooie had to redo the um, bracketing, and so I found myself facing him. Uh, and that's something I definitely did not want, um, you know, you don't want to go up against the tournament director in a tournament. Uh, they're the people who probably put the most thought into their teams. And um, so this battle is, you know, I started with Roserade, um, but um, I was predicting a fake out, and so um, I switched into Quants, um, not expecting him to use Aerial Ace, and definitely not expecting that um, he would run Brick Break, even though I'm pretty sure I saw him use Brick Break in the last in his last battle, that was a mistake on my part. So now I'm down Quants. Um, my Tyranitar is gone. And so um, I have Kamiko, um, my Flygon, go ahead and use Outrage, um, which goes ahead and takes out his Ambipom, um, which is uh, good, I guess, because that Ambipom is pretty darn versatile. Um, and so then he sends out um, Mesprit, um, and I'm just locked into Outrage until it's done, uh, and so we're just going to have to see what Mesprit decides to do. Um, Mesprit decides to take the opportunity to put up a Reflect, um, which is going to save it from dying on the next turn, um, yeah, because of the Sandstorm damage. Um, Outrage done just about 50%, although he's got Leftovers Recovery, so it was maybe 50-50, but anyway, um, Outrage is now going to do much, much less damage. Um, and Mesprit is going to survive quite easily and is going to be able to continue setting up. Uh, gets up a nice stealth rock. Um, poor little uh, Flygon. Um, and uh, I don't get, I'm not able to get my stealth rock up because um, Quance was taken out before he could do it. Um, she could do it. Anyway, I go ahead uh, and switch to Onion once the outrage is over. Um, and. Uh, uh, he goes ahead and uses Psychic with his Mesprit, which does about 50% to Onion, um, my Ludicolo. Um, so I'm sick of this Sandstorm, it's not going to do me any more good in this battle, so I go ahead and um, switch to Rain. Um, I was also thinking that maybe that's the only way that uh, Onion could outspeed it, but if you'd actually looked at that, um, how the Sandstorm damage worked out, Ludicolo was hit first, so Ludicolo was faster. Um, uh, anyway, he uses his Mesprit, um, uses Thunder Wave, so now Ludicolo is going to be slower. So I pull, I, um, pull back Onion, um, and send out, um, Celebi, my nice little cleric. Um, and so he's going to go ahead and use Psychic, but it's resisted. Um, I was thinking he would be neutral because I'm so used to grass types being grass poison. And, um, so in my head, grass types, uh, you know, are weak to Psychic, even though they're really not. Um, but so it, that was a nice little, like, oh yeah, moment. Um, so I go ahead and use Heal Bell, even though I'm pretty sure I can take him out with my attacks, um, with Celebi, um, thanks to the Reflect being down. Um, he goes ahead and uses Thunder Wave, um, which sucks, um, and goes ahead and puts up a Reflect um, before I can go ahead and attack. Um, and I'm going to go ahead and use U-Turn, uh, which is going to not take out uh, Mesprit. It actually, from this amount of damage, it looks like it wouldn't have taken out Mesprit, even though it was super effective. Um, and I've invested a considerable amount of attack into Celebi. It doesn't look like it would have taken, him, uh, taken it out anyway. Um, so I go ahead and send out Yon Mega, um, as good of a time as any, um, and I'll go ahead and take it out with um, Bug Buzz. Um, and so there goes uh, his Mesprit. Uh, I'm glad about that. Uh, Mesprit is kind of a pain in my tuchus. Um And uh, I've and then the rain stopped. Uh, I kind of, I guess I edited out so you didn't really see the rain, so the rain didn't actually help me at all. So anyway, I stupidly leave Serenity in to use Bug Buzz, um, forgetting about, um, I didn't forget that he had Sound Block, I just forgot that Sound Block blocked Bug Buzz. Um, so rather than being able to send in Yon Mega one more time, um, since it's got an odd HP value, um, uh, I'm out, or Yon Mega is out, which sucks. Um, so I go ahead and send out um, El Kabong, um, 
and I'm going to go ahead and set up some spi uh, some toxic spikes, um, get some kind of entry hazards in. But um, first, not without doing sleep powder first, or using sleep powder first, which um, takes out his drift blim, uh, just you know, uh, disables his drift limb rather. And then once I do this, I realize, wait a minute, this is really stupid because even though I edited it out, I actually took careful note of his uh, selection screen, and he's got a Drapion on his team. So the second he sends out his Drapion, um, you know, my strategy is ruined. Um, so I've got to go ahead and do something else. Um, basically, sorry, uh, Drapion is part poison type, uh, and so would have cleared the toxic spikes. So I go ahead and send an onion who, uh, luckily, uh, his uh, drift blimp stays asleep. Um, I go ahead and use rain dance. Um, you know, even though he's faster, the power boost is going to be nice. Um, he just keeps on sleeping. Uh, kind of unlucky there, um, but I go ahead and use surf, um, which don't think it takes out. No, no. Uh, his his Pokemon survives with quite a bit of health, um, but I'm going to take him out on the next turn. Um, yeah, I was really lucky that um, his uh, Drift Blimp stayed asleep for so long. That was a little bit of hacks on my part, I guess. Um, but that was really, really fortunate. Um, so Onion's down to very low HP, um, and he sends out uh, his Grumpig, uh, which I decide, you know, what the hell. Onion's got so little HP anyway, let's just go ahead and uh, do as much damage as I can. And I'm really disappointed because it doesn't quite take him out. Um, I've got, like, no HP left. And so Miss Piggy uh, uses Psychic, uh, which takes out, you know, takes out Onion. But um, thanks to those Toxic Spikes, um, sorry, I'm getting ahead of myself, Onion goes down. Um, but thanks to those Toxic Spikes, Miss Piggy actually goes down. So it's actually really great that I didn't set up two layers of Toxic Spikes. Um, in many cases, one layer is better than two. Um, and so I go ahead and send Flygon back out. Um, not sure who he's going to send out, but I've got U-turn on Kimiko. So whoever he sends out, if I don't like it, I can switch out. So he, yeah, he sends out Lady Gaga, which I'm pretty sure is, or he's down to two Pokemon left. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and switch out because um, I'm worried about that Drapion, and I need Kimiko to be there to uh, get it with Earthquake. So I switch out. I've got pretty much no one left. Um, Roserade, um, it's Roserade, Celebi, and um, Kimiko. Um, Ice Beam uh, would have murdered Kimiko, um, so I'm glad I switched even though it takes out um, Roserade. Uh, kind of a shame. Oh well, <laughs> nice dramatic death. Uh, I like that. Um, so now no more rain. Um, not that it helps me or hurts me in any way at this point. Celebi goes out, um, and uh, I'm going to try to get in one good attack, and I'm gonna, so I'm going to use a Seed Bomb, which is not quite going to take out Lady Gaga, um, which, oh well. Um, so he uses Ice Beam, which I'm hoping maybe Celebi, with its pretty good defenses, can survive. No such luck. Celebi goes down. Um, Again, very dramatically. I like these dramatic little animations. But again, the poison uh, the poison does me good, and uh, Lady Gaga goes down. Um, and so he's down to his last Pokemon, and so am I. So out goes um, Kimiko, my Flygon, um, and out goes his Drapion, who he's been saving, um, and who's going to clear the spikes. Um, so it's uh, it was a mistake on his part not to send out uh, Drapion sooner, I think. But anyway, Earthquake uh, is going to one-hit KO. It wasn't holding a sash or anything. So the battle is now over. Uh, and I have won. I have beat the tournament director, and I'm going to be advancing to round three. I was not expecting this. Um, I was really, really shocked. I was partying quite loudly um, when I realized I'd won. Anyway, comment, rate, subscribe, and challenge.